in today's video, we are leaving the metro area and heading to the west side of Puerto Rico. We will be staying at an Airbnb in Maya West. And why are we going to Maya West? Well, we have an event tonight, so we need to change. I already have my makeup on and I need to fix my hair. But tonight is the event at Maya West Resort and Casino. And it's the 25 year high school reunion. And I say we because it's me and this guy right here. Yes, fun fact, we graduated same town, Cabo Rojo, same school, same year, 1997. I know, crazy. We know each other from then, but we never spoke in high school. Fun fact for you. <laughs> so I'm very excited to be going to this event and being on the west side of the island. And since we're there, we might as well make a video. So I'm not sure exactly what I'm doing yet, but maybe I'll make a video of my OS or somewhere around there. But anyway, let's just go and I'll see you over there. I have not been to a church's chicken in years and here we are stuffing our face and I had to order a honey biscuit because they're so good. This is where we're staying. Hmm. Seems like a shady neighborhood. But let's go inside. We would not recommend this Airbnb, but luckily we were here for just one night. Wow, this has been a rough morning. Barely got any sleep. We got to the Airbnb very, very late. And we are heading to eat right now because we are starving. So we're gonna try to find a local place to get some breakfast desayuno in Maya West. This is Google Barcha, which is passion fruit. We love it. Oh, fancy. He got coffee. What's this? Farina? Farina. Farina. Here is my food French toast, scrambled eggs, bacon, hash brown. This is his food. Tuna. Tuna, tuna, I couldn't get it. <laughs> Let me take you on a little tour of Maya West. Maya West, Colegio de Maya West. The shopping. I did my belly button piercing when I was like 20 years old in this shopping. Fun fact, my boyfriend Sergio that is sitting right next to me graduated with a bachelor's degree from this university right here. Right here we have La Cervecera de Puerto Rico, which has been producing beer and other beverages since 1938. This is Puerto Rico's local beer company that produces Medalla, Medalla Light, Magna, Silver Key, and my personal favorite, Malta India. Oh my God, I used to eat in that Burger King when I used to go out drinking right over here. 
I was a Budweiser model. There was something here. It was a bar. There was a bar up there. Down there, I used to work as a bartender over here and a Budweiser model here. So some are still there, some are not. Lo Frikis, right there. The whole street gets packed with people on Thursdays, like students from the university and colleges, and it will get packed. Get home at six in the morning. I recently learned that you can take an actual ferry to go to DR. So if you want to go to Punta Cana, you just hop on a ferry from here. These are the offices and the port is nearby. This area right here is where you take the road test when you want to become a driver. So when I was 16, this is where I took it. So this same area where you take the road test, they called it La Atonera. When you used to pass by here back in the day, there was a very, very strong smell here, but I didn't smell it this time. The reason for the strong smell was because Bumblebee Tuna Packing Hub was located here. Unfortunately, reduction in production volumes impacted costs and no longer could sustain operations in Puerto Rico. Therefore, they closed in 2012. Mayawiz is known to have flea markets and they are very early. This was around noon on a Sunday and they were already packing up to leave. So if you are interested in them, make sure you know where they are and the time. This is Parque Litoral, which is a long park less than three miles long with Maya West Bay views. It has children's park, skate park, trails to walk and ride bike, etc. Across the street, they have the Litoral Stadiums, where they had the 2010 Central American and Caribbean Games. Over there. No! And get ready and boom, yeah.